For today, let's look at this inequality question. Let x, y, z be real numbers such that the sum of square equals 1. We are asked to find the maximum value of this expression that is square 6xy plus 4yz. I'm going to use just AMG inequality to solve this question. Please have a good try before you look at the answer. Pause the video now if you wish to solve it. Keep watching the video once ready. Here's a very interesting trick for this question. We we'll say j to be square of 6xy plus 4 of yz. This is square of 6 and for 4, it can be written as square of 16yz. Then we know that uh, the sum of 6 and 16 is equal to 22 and it gives us some idea. That is, we we'll consider x squared plus 6 over 22 y squared. Using AMG inequality, this will be greater than or equals to double of square root 6 over 22 xy. And similarly, we we'll consider 16 over 22 y squared plus z squared. Using AMG inequality, this will be greater or equals to double square root of 16 over 22 y z and we add up everything together then we will see that we have x square and we have y square and z square so the left hand side is equal to x square plus y square plus z square and for the left hand side it will be equal to 2 over square 22 and this is square of 6xy plus 4 of yz if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. This part of the expression on the right is exactly equals to j. And we will see that this will be less than equal to x square plus y square plus z square times square of 22 over 2. And given that x square plus y square plus z square equals 1, so this is just equals to square root of 22 over 2. And as usual, we want to ask whether the equality holds. The equality holds if and only if from here, x square equals to 6 over 22 y square. And from here, 16 over 22 y square equals to z square. So with this condition, we know that the sum of square equals 1. So x square we write as 6 over 22 y square. y square as y square. z square as 16 over 22 y square. So the sum of this will be 2 y square equals 1. And therefore y can be plus minus 1 over square of 2. And by some calculation, then we see that the equality holds if and only if x, y, z equals to square root 3 over 22, 1 over square root 2, square root of 8 over 22. Or it can be a negative of square root 3 over 22, a negative 1 over square root 2, and negative square root of 8 over 22. So it means that the value of j equals square 22 over 2 is achievable and therefore the maximum value for j is equal to square 22 over 2. That's all for today's lesson. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.